Ruby, let's go feed the horses. Let's go feed the horses. Come on. Let's go feed the horses. morning guys I'm at the barn and I'm doing chores alone because we are off to go uh, for a long drive this morning it's good Friday and we usually spend it in Toronto with my parents in Toronto and yeah we pitch and uh, muscles and stuff like that but anyways I'm all alone at the barn this morning while everyone else gets ready and I'm so impressed I remembered everybody's grain and I know exactly what they have to get now. Got it all laid out and now I'm going to feed them and put up the hay for the whole day that we're gone. As you can see it's a crappy rainy day and I'll be putting the food inside. Oh now it's starting to pour. To today's video, did you take care of the chickens? Mm -hmm. They have all fresh food and water. Hi guys! Where's your sweater? In my basket. Sophie and I went shopping last night. I'm down six sizes. Wow, I had no idea. In jeans, six sizes in jeans. In my shirts, this is shirt that I'm wearing is a size large, and it's like clearly a bit big. It's a bit big, so I could probably go back to a medium. Oh, how was your chocolate and your coffee? Good. It was good? All right, let's get ready and head out. So if you had to wash your hair today, I was away last night and she washed her hair before at bedtime and I don't know what happened, but she had some crazy hair this morning, huh? Ooh. All right, so last night we did a competition and it was who does nighttime barn routines best? And you guys saw that they didn't check the stalls to make sure everybody was fed and Finn spun Sam around. If I have that clip, I'll put it in again right here because it was so freaking funny. I was laughing so hard. Are you ready for Finn? Oh, Finn's got a bowl. And they also forgot to put the feed bowls out of the stalls. We always take them out of the stalls at night and you guys forgot and Stella pooped in hers. <laughs> Sam came home and he's like, you guys did not take out the, the feed pans and I was panicking. I was upstairs getting ready and I'm like, oh my gosh, what happened? What happened? And he's like, Stella pooped in hers. I'm like, okay, get down. Like you need to laugh. Yeah, you wanna say hi to them? Like you need to laugh. Our, our pets are all like super loving. That's the problem with us. We over love. Chores are done and we are headed into Toronto to spend a good Friday with Sam's family. Um, the first order of today was to get our coffee. This is a ice, ice cappuccino and it is the yummiest drink. I ordered a medium and it accidentally supersized it for me. That was amazing. So I got a large. Hopefully the rest of the day turns out as amazing as that. 
Uh, what'd you get, Sophie? Bagel. What'd you get, Gabby? Ice caps. Ice caps are really good. Anyway, the cool thing that we do when we travel is we have this orange thing here. It's called Sky Roam, and uh, the kids can have internet while we travel. It's amazing. It keeps the ride and nice and quiet and nice and relaxed, and um, we get there with no problems. <laughs> tomorrow on Saturday the day that you're actually watching this at 5 p.m. we are gonna be at our local tech store called Bridal Path in Belleville Ontario um, and we're gonna be meeting Amberly Snyder Amberly Snyder from Walk Ride Rodeo she's gonna be at our tech store at 5 p.m. we're gonna be there too um, she's doing a meet-and-greet and I want to invite anybody who's local or who can come to come there and meet her and meet us. And if you do see us there, don't forget to say hi. All right, you guys. Surprise! We are back home. We ended up not vlogging in Toronto. We went to Sam's parents' house for a Good Friday. Do you guys eat fish on Friday? On Good Friday, we always eat fish. Um, I took a picture. I made Sam take a picture of the highlight of what Gabby and Sam eat. They eat mussels. So they are muscle lovers. I'm going to put a picture in there. Uh, we also spent some time with um, their Gabby and Sophie's cousins and Sam's parents. I'm going to put a picture in there so you guys can see what we did. Kind of awkward sometimes to vlog with other people there. Anyways, we had to cut our visit short because, duh, we have horses at home that need us. So we're home. It is early, and we still have to muck the stalls. But before we do that, um, the girls want to show you what they got for their very first Me? Easter haul. All right, Gabby, what did you get for Easter at your grandparents' house? So this is for my birthday. She got a card for her birthday. I got a card, and in the card was. A gift card. All right. gift card. So it is a $25 gift certificate for any of these restaurants, 10 plus restaurants. So she can go and have some supper. I got this little bag of Easter stuff. Okay, so let's start with this. Is that a birthday carry? Yes, this is my birthday present too, inside of an Easter. So now that Gabby and Sylvia are a little bit older, their grandparents don't buy them presents anymore. Instead, they get money. Money. So how much money did you get? Birthday, Easter birthday. So it's true. She got money from her grandfather for Easter and from her grandmother and her grandfather for her birthday. And she got $250. She also got... This whole bag of candy. I'm praying that the Easter Bunny did not bring is not bringing too much candy to our house because the girls have all this junk now, and I'm trying to keep us junk free. Favorite, Dad's favorite, this one is Dad's favorite. Yeah, your mom picks good candy, Sam. All right, Sophie, what did you get for Easter so, this year at your grandparents' house? I got this for Easter because it's not my birthday, so this is just for Easter. Yeah. All the money I got, but it's a hundred, so I can on double star coins, so. Yeah, so the thing that the girls really like to do with their mm -hmm. Easter money every single year is buy double, is wait for a double star, star coin weekend and buy star coins. Okay, and I also got these, and we had one of these, but in miniature form, like in the miniature little packets. So we ate that on the car ride because we're, we're kind of wanting to eat it. So I got these. I got these little M&Ms. No. She got this little chocolate and this, and this little smarty chocolate. So lots of chocolate. Let's eat it. Lots of money. No, no more chocolate for today. Gabby, you're rolling in the money. Go in the bank. One thing that you guys might not know about my kids is that Sophie loves to spend all her money and buy stuff. Gabby likes to 
hoard her money. Don't you like to hoard your money? We're buying double star coins today. Yeah, is it's it double star coins right now. Oh, lucky. I think it is. Today we had to feed our horses all of their daily allotment in the morning, and that sucks because they're always hungrier at night. So we're feeding them a little bit early tonight. Look at our girl just trotting around. Good girl. This ball was in here last night. And where was it now? Oh, they were playing. And of course they moved that pole. We missed you. Aw, look at how friendly he is. Oh, aw. He understands, and Storm is like that too. She said, can I have a kiss, and he went to her. Oh, hi, handsome. It's hard. We came down just quickly to put them in and clean their stalls, but it's hard not to be in love with them. It's hard not to be in love with them. He needs a treat now. Oh, Stella, are you gonna kiss? Oh, good girl. Let's get them a treat. You know how everybody says like, the only thing that matters in life is family. It's all about family. Family is the most important. Yeah, that's a lie, you guys. Who cares about family when you have horses? <laughs> Just kidding. One, letting in the horses, nighttime routine, and we asked you guys to judge them. And tonight we're gonna show you team two, me and Gabby, um, our nighttime routine, and you guys are gonna choose below. Team one, Sophie and Sam. Team two, Laura and Gabby. And you guys are gonna see who has the best nighttime routine. Uh, Gabby, what are you doing? I actually like that. Oh, these are the ones we don't use? Whoa, that was a big mess, but they look good. Good job. Ready to come in? I know, you've been so hungry, huh? I always try and get like a really nice picture of all three of them together. Sometimes they come out and they're standing together, but I always miss it. It's too bad Sam, the poop man. Oh. I just thought of the best name, Sam the poop man. Uh, isn't that good? To recap, I'm gonna put Sam and Sophie team one video right here. Don't forget to notice that Sam bounced off the walls, did a little somersault right here, and that they forgot Stella's food. Stella is amazing. Stella like, look at her, away. she's just all calm. Stella doesn't have any brains. Yeah, you have to make it. You have to. She sees all the new stuff. <laughs> Come on, put her in there. Wait, she has to see. She has to see the new mat. Yeah, get this one as a brain. They failed. They didn't have any grain in Stella's stall. Well, Gabby's supposed to do it. Nope. Does Finn have grain? I mean, Stella. I mean, Stella. Willow. Did you guys put the food in? No. Well, no. wait a second. Don't tell us. We're ah, they didn't put the food in and they were ready to go. No, we're not ready to go. Yeah, see how they cheat? And I'd just like to say one thing. They've already learned from all our mistakes and they still forgot the food. They learned from our mistakes. They should be perfect today. Yeah. If they're not perfect today, then we should win. So comment down below. Sam and Sophie team, the, the S team wins. The S team wins? Alright, let's see if they come here. This is gonna take forever. Come on, Gabby, don't screw up. <laughs> Please screw up. Then you have a whip in your hand. Okay, Gabby, you can have a whip in your hand. Wow. Wow, yeah. what do you think? We oh. should win because the horses actually came in. Yeah, I know, come they came on. in. We're still Why waiting. Why off for them? Uh -oh. They're all running around it. Holy jeez, man. Why? Be 
Why don't I bolt it in there? I don't know if that was a uh, nice move. Come on. Well, Willow. Last one, can they do it? Come on, Stella. If she tramples me, stay loose. Oh my god, she just went outside. Point to you know. You have it's because Gabby has whips. Two oh, points for the back. Whoa. Don't trample me. What do you, want to do? you guys will lose. I think Sophie and I should win because, and here's why, because the horses, they went in one at a time and they were ready to come in, whereas when Laura and Gabby did it, it looked like they were afraid. Yeah, because looked Gabby like had they a were whip. Afraid to come in, and I don't, don't know. Don't do that. Uh, vote for us, please. And to be fair, Gabby had a whip. She had a dressage whip in her hand. I don't know why she did that. She thought it would be better. And Willow sometimes bolts past, and Finn bolts past, so I don't want to die. Mm -hmm. Alright, so you guys choose team one or team two. Pick team two. Team two. Pick team S. Team S for Sophie. And team S is for Sam and Sophie. Team L is for Laura and Gabby. No. <laughs> team Laga. Yeah, Laga. No, All no, right. no, no, no. Go off. Team Glora. Glora. <laughs> I'll go with that. That is it for today. Thank you guys so much for watching. Tomorrow is going to be a crazy, fun, amazing vlog. We have so many plans for tomorrow. Tomorrow is Easter Saturday, and boy, it is going to be a busy one. We'll see you guys later. And don't forget to make sure to hit that subscribe button down below.